Hello booktube, um, this is uh, my video to join in, I probably could phrase that better, but to join in with the March of the Mammoths, uh, uh, hosted by uh, Big Al Books, Totally Pretentious, an old blues chapter and verse, I'll leave links down below. You read a tome or large volume, 800 pages or more I believe. And uh, for that, I've chosen Tom Clancy with Mark Greeny. Uh, Mark Greeny is actually the author I'm interested in here um, because he has a new series, well, not so new series, a new series to me, Gray Man novels. So I wanted to see um, some of his early work. He's a thriller writer, and uh, early on he did some Tom Clancy novels that I've heard were quite good. So this is Locked On. And there's Clancy on the back. I don't believe, yeah, this does not have an image of Mr. Greeny on it. It is, let's see how many pages we got here, so I'm following the rules. 853. It came out in um, G.P. Putnam Sons, New York. And it is um, 2011, so it's been out for a while. So, uh, the story is, although his father had been reluctant to become a field operative, Jack Ryan Jr. wants nothing more. Privately training with a seasoned Special Forces drill instructor, he's honing his skills to transition his work with the campus from intelligence an analyst to hunting down and eliminating terrorists wherever he can. Even as Jack Ryan Sr. campaigns for re-election as President of the United States. But what neither father nor son knows is that the political and personal have just become equally dangerous. A devout enemy of Jack Sr. launches a privately funded vendetta to discredit him by connecting the presidential candidate to a mysterious killing in the past by John Clark, his longtime ally. A shadow, shadowy mercenary team is dispatched to capture the former Navy SEAL. With Clark on the run, it's up to Jack Ryan Jr. along with Ding Chavez, Dominic Caruso, and the rest of the campus team to stop a threat emerging in the Middle East. A corrupt Pakistani general has entered into a deadly pact with a fanatical terrorist to procure nuclear warheads, which can be used to blackmail any world power into submission. With the breakneck speed and military action scenes that have made him the premier thriller writer of our time, Tom Clancy delivers a novel of high-tech warfare in which the enemy within may be even more devastating than the enemy without. So yeah, um, like I say, I've read Tom Clancy in the past, um, but I'm really into this to read about Mark Greeny. Um, he has a degree in international relations and political sciences and pursuing his master's in intelligence studies with a concentration in criminal intelligence. He's the author of The Gray Man, On Target, and Ballistic. In his research for these novels, he traveled to seven countries and trained alongside military and law enforcement in the use of firearms, battlefield medicine, and close-range combat tactics. So it's a thriller. Um, I'm looking forward to it. Looking forward to, like I say, reading Mark Greeny. Um, if it's good and I like his writing, um, I'll move on to the Gray Man novels. Uh, I, mean, I probably will anyway. So this is, um, like I say, March of the Mammoths. And it's hosted by Big Al Books, Totally Pretentious, and Old Blues Chapter and Verse. So uh, thank you, Booktube.